I guess this really doesn't mean much. Why are there so many zombies over here? Why are there so many zombies over here? Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I might as well take advantage of this. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. All right. How's it going, guys? I'm the Kiwi Gamer, and welcome back to the Better Minecraft Mod Pack, where it is finally freaking happening. We are actually going to build ourselves a mob grinder today because I am tired of waiting to do it. Freaking the steps to do it have been such a freaking pain in the butt, but you know what? We're ready. We can do it. We just need to figure out where to put it. I kind of have an idea. Maybe just a little bit. Now, before we do get started with that, though, you probably noticed a couple of changes in my inventory. So, I've been kind of working hard trying to basically scam all our villagers and try and get as many emeralds as physically possible. So that way I can get ourselves some new better tools so that I can, uh, well, get more scam currency from those guys, pretty much. Like a cycle. Like you have to do bad to get good and then do more bad to get even more good. Uh, it's kind of weird. Either way, I now have a diamond axe and a diamond shovel, all with some pretty freaking decent enchantments. The shovel I'm still a little iffy on because it has silk touch. Yeah, not uh, not entirely sure about that, but each of them have mending. We shouldn't have to worry about them going away, so I'm pretty cool with that. Unfortunately, though, they are not netherite yet because I still do need to go into the nether. And I gotta go mine for some netherite, so that's kind of a pain in the butt, but you know what? I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. But first, we are going to do the mob grinder because I'm tired of not doing it. We will do it. Now, I do kind of have the idea of how I want this to go, if I can actually remember where I put all the soul stuff that we had. Uh, where'd I put it? Did I actually lose it? Hello? Where did I put all my soul stuff? Oh, what? What? I swear I opened up this chest and it's just all of a sudden shows up. Okay, that's kind of weird. Uh, anyway. I need this thing. I need to also figure out what we're going to put it in. I'm definitely putting actually skeletons in there, so never mind. We already know what we're doing. So yeah. I just gotta set the thing up. It's not gonna be like an extravagant thing. It's just gonna be like a basic little mob grinder, but I do kind of want to put it under the base so that way it will always be spawning skellies and I will always have a ever-flowing amount of experience going into my body. I think that works out pretty well. So honestly, I was kind of thinking about putting like a little staircase down to this over here and have the entrance of it be in this little area right here. I'm not entirely sure if that's what I want to do yet. I could just put it honestly right here. I mean, I could. I could do either or. Either or will work. Either or will work. Apparently, I also can't speak today. I am freaking like messing up my words today. So sorry in advance if I say anything that sounds really weird. I'm just having a lot of trouble with speech today. Okay. I got to make sure I angle it downwards so that way we don't accidentally build into the place. Yo, can the creepers not be a thing? Go away. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to accidentally build it into the base. So... I don't need to go down that far either because actually now that I think about it. Oh, hold on, hold on, wait. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so if you actually do press U on it, you can actually see all this really cool info on it. Uh, since we have the advanced one, needs players within 32 blocks. Okay. 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 So, crap. Spawns up to nine blocks away. So that means that we need to make sure that it's going to be big enough to actually have all the mobs or else things, uh, bad things might happen. I'd really prefer them not to happen. Knowing my luck, they're probably going to end up happening anyway. Thinking over here would work fine. We're almost under the base, but I, I think that should be still within the range that I need for this. But I think first we're going to clear out like a little room so that way we can actually get like everything sorted out. Um, I don't know how big it's going to be. I don't need it to be huge. Although I do need it to at least have a craft on a freaking chest. Actually, you know what? Ooh, hold on. 
kind of get an idea in my head and I'm kind of potentially stealing from an old series I used to watch. Oh, that might be too close. Oh crap, I might actually need to bring it down even more. It's 102, so it's like, what, gonna be 20 blocks below? That might be fine, maybe? Okay, well, either way, I have an idea. I have an idea. Okay, I kinda have the plan. Kinda have the plan. So what I want to happen, I want the skellies to fall onto these two blocks. That means I need to make a pillar just like that. Okay. I kind of forgot. Freaking baby skeletons are a thing. Those things are going to be annoying. Ah. So let me, let me clear this out real quick so I can kind of get the idea going. Yeah. So I'll have them like fall. Okay. That's not what I meant to do. I'll have them like fall down here. And we could put little half uh, half slabs there. Now, the reason I'm kind of wanting them to fall like this is because I think this might help out with the entity cramming. I'm pretty sure I didn't set it to like infinite in this world. So that could end up being a potential issue. Could. And like I said, baby skellies are a thing, so we will actually need to do the half slabs. Eh. But now I just need to like build the actual pathway. I need to not build into the base either. That's going to be the, that's going to be the hard part. Oh man. Three hours later. I, okay. 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 Kind of have a little concern here. Um, I wish it wasn't so like one sided. <laughs> Like, I guess if there was like a way I can just have it like right in the middle, that would work. But I would have to do so much more digging. Like I would have to go, well, actually. Mostly I would just have to dig out like this exact same type of setup, but over there. I, I think. That wouldn't be that bad. But I have to like figure out how many blocks this is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that means I would have to bring this out eight and I would have to do the exact same thing. And then I could put it like right here and then things will be possibly good. Kind of. Also right now it looks hideous. Still kind of working on it, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Kind of have the idea now. Kind of have the idea. Okay. Okay. Let's move this over here. We'll put it, I think that high should be okay. I severely hope that'll be okay. Maybe I should raise the roof just by two, just to make sure. But honestly, I just want to make sure this thing freaking works. <laughs> like this is, I don't know. Like I know this is a modded thing and everything, but the mechanics should still basically be vanilla, right? Right? Okay. Okay. What the heck was that? Okay, that was weird. Uh, definitely lag. <laughs> Let's hope that doesn't happen frequently. Theoretically, this should be it, right? Just occurred to me the skellies will probably freaking bump into each other and won't allow them to go. So I gotta be careful of that. It may not hinder it that much. At least I really hope that's gonna be the case. But this should essentially work. I don't see a reason as to why it wouldn't. So let me put that there. Get back up here, give me another water. Thank you. Uh. When was it? This one. Okay. So that should be fine. So now all I need to do is put the crystal in. Let's see how this goes. Oh God, I hope this works. Boom. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. We gotta get this hole closed up before they start piling out. Okay. 
But theoretically, it should work. Okay. Now I do still need to put half slabs down here, so that would not be a bad idea. Uh, hmm. Oh, that's not um, as far as I wanted that to be. Okay, well, crap. Uh, okay. I'm gonna let this sit for a moment. I'm gonna I'm gonna go get those half slabs, so that way I don't uh, screw things up. That thing should just keep growing. It should seriously just keep growing and growing and growing until the entity cramming cap, and then they'll probably just start dying. I'll be sad. Well, that's just how things go. Uh, can I get some half slabs up in here? Thank you. Thank you. Now the skelly's still there. They are still there. They're kind of being weird. They're kind of pushing each other into the separate blocks. Interesting. So what if I put a half slab there? Okay. Okay. I mean, I can still see them, but maybe I take the flooring down by one. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Yeah, probably not because that allows me to kind of get to it a lot easier. So we'll do that. Okay, cool, cool. So this is, this is looking fine. Definitely looking okay for now. Definitely got to spruce this thing up and so far still no entity cap on these guys. And yeah, what if I hit him right now? Eh. Let's try and fix up my pickaxe. Uh, nothing? Wait, what? Yeah, I was going to say... Oh, it's already fixed. I didn't even hear the en the experience go into me. Okay. That's pretty cool. That is a lot of freaking bones and stuff. <laughs> Realistically, I don't need all this stuff, but still, that's pretty good. <laughs> all right. Uh, can I do like little half slabs here so I can get up here just a little bit easier? Yeah, I like that. Okay, sick. I'm actually really liking this. I could just make this whole floor. No, no, I can't. Well, I mean, I could. It's kind of weird that I actually do like this flooring a lot. And the aesthetic of all the cobblestone and things like popping out of it, it's just so good. It's just so good. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I need to fix that at some point. I gotta somehow get that figured out. All right, so. Oh, you know what? Oh, you know, no, 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 that should be fine. Yeah, and the staircase can just go, yeah, just like that. Oh, it actually worked out a lot better than I thought it would. Huh. Everything's still good. I hit my head. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, what, why, no, no, no. I didn't just hear a raid. Oh, I see the illager. Oh, please don't, no, no, no. Wait, who even rang the bell? Or was that them? Oh no, okay, I, no, no, no. You don't need to be here. Go away. What is your name? Okay. <laughs> uh, do I kill the guy with the, what you call it? I don't want to. I don't trust it. Ow. Okay, we good. I think we're okay. Well, that's annoying. What the heck? Oh, well, there's the entity cramming. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, it's happening. All right. Wow, it's like every hit is one level. Holy crap. <laughs> it's working out pretty good. It's actually working out rather well. Hmm. I do kind of want to build this up a little bit, make the room look a little bit nicer. Except I don't know exactly how to do that. Only issue is, if I do this. Uh, I mean, that, would, that should still be fine. I just gotta make sure I don't break these blocks and we should be good. Now, now that I think about it, I do kind of wish there was also like a direct link up to the base. 
something that would make it a little bit easier to get to if I need to real quickly. Don't know for sure how I can do that. Hmm. Could I have possibly like a staircase going from each side? You know what I mean? It's possible? But I may need to do it a little bit differently. More than likely. Hmm. What is that? What is that stupid little thing? What is that thing? I don't know what that is. <laughs> it shows up all the time. But I seriously don't know what it is. What if I do like two staircases, one here? Oh no, maybe not that. Wait. Maybe I turn, ooh, I keep thinking of stuff. I keep thinking of stuff, things keep coming to my head. I don't know if it's good or bad. <laughs> what if I turn this into a little different room where I could put like enchanting stuff and this can be a staircase out maybe? Or at least to wherever I can actually get to. <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of right under it, and it'll lead to about right here. So I don't, I don't know for sure. Yeah, no, I really don't know for sure how I want to do that. Maybe I could do it like right here and maybe just go this way to do a staircase up. I could do that. That'll bring us up like right by the house. That may not be a bad idea. And I don't think I should run into the spawner itself. We could try that. I think we can. I actually kind of like where that ends up. Okay, okay, cool, cool. We might be able to work with that. Sweet. We could definitely put like a little staircase kind of leading downwards, a little path. All right, all right. I'm kind of getting how I want this to be. I'm liking it. All right, cool. So now we actually have a way out. Sweet. And then these two I can convert into like one bigger room, turn it into like an enchantment sta uh, station, storage area, basically anything that I want to. I guess I'll keep this so that way I could also like go out through this way because why not? Uh, but I'm, I'm digging this. Definitely I'm digging this. Oh, these guys are kind of annoying. That is a lot of experience. I know it's only like one or two levels, but considering that that gives me the opportunity to do two different level 30 enchantments, that's pretty freaking good. That is really freaking good. I need chests down here really bad. 38 chests. Do I really need 38 chests? I really don't. <laughs> uh, I'll take 16 for now. There we go. I think that'll be more than enough to at least kind of get things sorted. Oh man. I can tell this is already gonna be a lot. With having looting on this thing, yeah, yeah this is gonna be crazy. <laughs> I will say, at least I can, I'm gonna get like a freaking crap ton of emeralds out of this because all of that bone meal, it's gonna be nice. Definitely gonna be nice. Let's throw the chest. You know what? Let's put them in here. Yeah, let's just do this real quick. Yeah, and the chest can kind of like stick out like this. Wait. Didn't I not do that at the base because there were issues with that? I, I don't even know. I don't even know anymore. I swear I thought I had issues with that. Oh, wait, no, no, no. No, 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 we just didn't have, okay, right, duh, I'm done. All right, it works. <laughs> oh, this is all, oh my God, this is gonna be so many different things. Pretty much all skelly drops. And as soon as I can figure out if I could actually put other mobs in the mob spawners, then it's gonna be a lot more than just skellies, that is for sure. Holy crap. All right, well, already filled up one full chest. <laughs> Oh, this is ridiculous. This is actually ridiculous. 
Can skellies even drop anything else that's good? Like, is that a thing? I seriously have no idea. Also, I want to keep that. Let's keep those two. I will say, with all that experience we have, though, I do think it's time that we go ahead and enchant ourselves a nice little bow. Because I have not been doing that for whatever reason. And, you know what? It's time. It's time. Also, there's... I thought skeletons can only drop broken ones. I guess not. That's kind of weird. Hmm. I mean, it's, I'm still cool with it. We should actually have a couple of enchanted books for this too. So if we don't get like anything we need, we can at least add, what is it? If I can find it. Uh, not that one. Oh, okay. We have a power five. So we can at least do that. And we have no others. Uh, yeah, no, we have no others. All right. We'll see what we get. Yeah, of course. <laughs> you know what? Sure. Okay. That's... That's fine. Right? I can really do with some of the other things, though. Hold on. What if I disenchant it and re-enchant it? <laughs> Seriously? Really? You're going to do that to me, game? That is so mean. Thank you. Okay, that that's better. That's a lot better. Plus, I could put mending on there, which I think I might. I will need to buy a couple more books, though. So good thing I was farming up some emeralds before we started today. All the villagers are sleeping because, of course. Can you guys wake up? It's daytime literally daytime wake up oh yeah the second i go up there yeah i see how it is you guys trying to make me think you're not sleeping i see how it is okay mending um what else can i put on there uh you know i actually have no idea well, let's go and throw this on Ooh, wait no hold on Okay, actually, hold on. Before I do that, are there any other types of bows? Okay. <laughs> there are. What? Huh. Soul steel bow. Oh. Right, that'll help. That would help us. With actually trying to, like, get more souls and stuff for different spawners. Ew. Okay, I'm curious about that. There's an ender bow, ice bow, secret bow, tri bow. Tri bow's kind of cool. But yeah, you get that from, is that the frost queen? Snow queen. Uh, Snow queen. Yeah. Okay. I think we'll stick with the regular bow. I think we'll stick with the regular bow. Because I want to get that dragon bow and I want to see how that works. Let's add these two together. And then these two. Okay. Is there like an easy way I could see what all enchantments go on this thing? Because yeah, I don't think it'll show me this. Yeah, no, it won't. That's kind of annoying. Put these back in here. Hmm. I would love to see what else I could do. Oh, I'm missing punch. Okay. I'm assuming I can't put infinity on it. Is punch the only one that I'm missing? Really? Because the other things are... For the crossbow, right? I don't know for sure. Yeah, the rest are curses. Okay. Soul Reaper. You can get that? Oh, wait. That actually... Wait, 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 wait. Where'd it go? It'll add more... It'll add more souls per kill. Oh, I need that. <laughs> oh, I need that so bad. Okay. Um. Well, is there any, I guess, modded ones that might do something? 
I guess there's really not. I mean, there is Soulbound. That would not be a bad one to have. But I don't think I have any Soulbound books. I do not. Okay. Well. Kind of annoying, but all right. Also, before I forget, while I have that soul speed, it does go on boots, right? Yes, it does. Sure, because I feel like we're actually going to be going to the nether again sometime soon. Okay. How's our skelly spawner doing? It is full. <laughs> so yeah, the entity cramming thing could be an issue. Could I add more blocks and just like allow it to like spread out? Can I do that? Is that something I could do? I'm actually a little curious on that. I kind of want to try. Let me get a couple of half slabs. I just want to see. I just want to see how this works. Oh yeah, I could just do that. And then do this. And then theoretically, if I break this and this, I mean, it kind of, they just, they're attacking each other though for reasons I don't quite understand. But I mean, it allows them to move around a little more, right? You can walk up there without an issue. Yeah. Yeah. And as long as they don't like get in the way, he shouldn't be able to shoot. So, okay, that kind of works. And that should help up with the entity cramming, right? I severely hope that will. Um, I'm gonna shorten this by a block though, because that's kind of annoying. Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. You know, I didn't think about this until now, but if I get my hands on another Skelly Soul Stone, if I were to throw it in there and then just farm the crap out of them, we can get an ultimate one pretty soon. <laughs> Because, I mean, this is insane. It's literally dropping almost one every second. I mean, come on. Still no entity cramming. Although you can kind of see them being fixed into certain blocks. Like those guys right there. Yeah, you can kind of see them being fixed in a spot. Oh! Okay, so whatever this freaking stupid mob is that I keep seeing. I don't like that. Uh, but every time I see this mob, okay. So it's definitely just a armored entity. Okay. I guess this really doesn't mean much. Why are there so many zombies over here? Why are there so many zombies over here? Oh my God. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I might as well take advantage of this. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. Hi. Yeah, I'll take your soul. Thank you. Why are there so many? <laughs> Why are there so many? Wait, where'd they go? Ah. Yeah, if you guys can leave my villagers alone, that would be really cool. Just want to throw that out there. Where'd they go? There were so many more here just a second ago, and now they're all gone. They were just here. What? Well, I was going to take advantage of that. Oh, man. That kind of sucks. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. I just thought of something that I kind of make sure I need to do. We'll need to get a new mending book and probably an unbreaking book. So let's actually grab another one. But yeah, I forgot about this. We got the Peacock Feather Fan quite a while ago and I... I really just haven't used it and I kind of want to. <laughs> uh, so I need a mending three or a mending, a mending three book. What is wrong with me? A mending book. Thank you. And an unbreaking book, which I have right here. Thank you. All right. Let me just add these two together. Boom, boom. There we go. And then boom, boom. Sweet. I don't know if you could actually do anything else with that. I really have no idea. But at least it's a lot better now. I love it. I absolutely love it. 
we can actually probably use this to kind of cheese over here too. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good idea to do that, but we could. Um, does that actually damage anybody? I'm curious. Chief, I see you. Saw you on the map. Hi. <laughs> so it does push him a little bit. Okay. But yeah, not really much else. Okay. <laughs> that is so weird though. Yep, you can do the same with them. <laughs> Let's try not to accidentally kill any villagers though. That would not be good. That would not be good. All right, well, you know what? I think I've been kind of rambling on enough trying to figure out what the heck I can actually try and do before we end it for today's episode. So I'm just going to go ahead and end it. And if it's short, it's short. Not really much I can do about that. But yeah, either way, we finally got ourselves a freaking mob grinder. It works so well. We already enchanted like, what, three different things today? And also uh, enchanted stuff with books and things. So we wasted a lot of levels. It feels so good being able to say, I can waste levels. That is really cool. So I do kind of want to keep working on actually trying to get more soul crystals. So that way we can try and get a variety of mobs going because I kind of want to see what other drops we can get. And if I can also get that Illager one, if that is a thing, that would be pretty useful. That'd be pretty useful because that would also give us a lot of emeralds. We could do a lot more trades and life will be good. Life would be very good. Also it is snowing. That's kind of cool. But either way, so if you guys enjoyed today's episode, I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel so that you guys can catch up on the rest of the series. Also, there's a link to my Discord in the description below if you guys want to check that out. It's a place where you guys can all talk amongst yourselves and get updates on new videos and live streams. So it's pretty freaking cool. There is also a link to my Patreon in the description as well. If any of you guys would like to do any extra support for the channel, it is entirely up to you. But if you do, you'll get your own sign, personalized sign in the base, and you also get will get a shout out on every Wednesday's episode. So that is also pretty freaking cool. So other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. And you all are awesome. <laughs>